quite a bit. <laughs> So, for the last week, um, I was uh, the great honor of being uh, nominated for an Academy Award. Uh, and, uh, it, was, it was quite a surprise because it was uh, a very little documentary that I wrote uh, a song for. But an important documentary, it was, a, uh, it was called Jim, and it was about a man called Jim Foley, who was a young... American photojournalist who was uh, beheaded by ISIS in 2014 in northern Syria. Pretty heavy subject, uh, as you can imagine. So I, I finished watching this movie and I was in a pool of, of tears. I was so moved and uh, emotional. And the producer said, well, can you write a song? I said, no fucking way can I write a song. It's, it's just too intense. I don't know how, I don't know how to do that. So anyway, I went home that night, it was Thanksgiving, and I, I sat with my wife and a couple of my kids, and I had this thought, I thought, you know, if one of my kids was in captivity, in danger, then what would I do? I'd probably have some ritual that would mean something to me. Maybe I'd leave an empty place at the table, or an empty chair, so that they could come back and fill it one day. And once I thought of that, I thought, oh, that's the, that's the metaphor to write this song. Um, so I wrote the song that night and sent it to the producers, and it's a song for the movie. We're ranked outsiders, we won't win, but it's, you know, for me, it's an important film because at this time, at this time, when journalism is under attack, when the truth itself is under attack, we need heroism in this young American show. And we can watch this movie and be so proud. It's called Jim, and the song is called The Empty Chair. Over land. 